Hey folks, what's going on? It's Saturday afternoon and um, actually I'm just back from um, a speaking engagement. Um, first one I've had since um, quitting my uh, former job as a mental health specialist. Uh, the Nebraska chapter of the National Alliance on Mental Illness um, uh, hired me to speak. Uh, yeah, I was paid. Thank you, These, this, you know, again, another avenue for me. But anyway, um, I was asked to speak on their, um, the theme of the conference. I wasn't the keynote speaker, but uh, I was the theme speaker, you know, which was strong voices, strong minds. And it was good to um, reconnect with that milieu. Saw a lot of people that I've worked with, haven't seen in a while. I used to be a member of NAMI. And uh, it, it really went well. And um, it just, again, um, uh, just reaffirming, life affirming. Um, each, I, I can't speak for you, but for me, it's important to think that I'm on my path and that my path is, is righteous, you know, that I'm not, you know, a slime ball, scumbag. That's important to me. Um, I think some people are fine with being scum, you know, there has to be some in the world that's because how would we know, um, we wouldn't know the difference if there was no difference anyway. Speaking at the conference and reconnecting with people um, was just an affirmation that, you know, what whatever criticism anyone can level at me, well, let them, that, so be it. I'm on my path, not theirs. That was a big part of my theme that, and message is that Besides actual symptoms of mental illness, many people, including me, are hurt and have been hurt and held back by other people's BS. In other words, other people's belief systems. You know, people put us, people put each other into trick bags all the time by judging and defining and trying to be more than, you know, or whatever, you know, and especially when it comes to uh, mental illness, which is still deeply misunderstood. Um, people that suffer from symptoms are so often victim, victimized. A lot of it coming from the inside, from accepting what the world has told you. So anyway, I'm just reflecting on that and happy to be able to share that message, you know, to dare to Stop believing other people's BS or stop listening to other people's BS, other people's belief systems. And that is not to, to belittle or to put down or to negate others' belief systems, but to discern when people are throwing shit at you that doesn't help you live well, be well, be happy, period. And there is a lot of that going on. So that was what was going on. The other thing I'm going to do here is... Honestly, I have um, I've received some via CLT from Simon in Poland, Pol and I want to thank you, Simon, who doesn't make videos, but he sent me this amazing, just reissued in Poland, uh, Neiman Enigmatic album, still sealed, and it's already a collector's item. Simon, I can't thank you enough. Just amazing. But... For me, what's even more amazing is right now, the, my favorite music to listen to right now is my own. I'm really, it's not a, it's not an egotistical masturbatory thing I'm sharing with you. I'm sharing with you that I love music. There's certain things that I like to hear in music that I'm always looking for. I'm pleased that I'm able to produce some of that. And some of the latest stuff that I'm working on, which is all still in process, um, even the stuff I've recently played in videos has changed since then. Um, it's just really, really enjoyable to listen to. Just, uh, you know, exhilarating. I played one of my pieces um, at the end of my talk at NAMI and um, got quite a response. Um, I, was, I was almost in tears. It was like I, I didn't, you know... So anyway, what I'm saying is I'm going to stop talking. I'm going to upload some 
pictures from this year and the audio of a at least one song, maybe two, that I've really been enjoying that they're still in process. I also want to share that I appreciate people's feedback. Um, I do hear the uh, input about female vocals on that one track. I can hear it. We'll see what happens. But I feel like sometimes I have to point people back to what I said, which is um, I make this music for me, number one. So, I'll make it for me. I'm happy to share it with you, but um, so anyway, let me shut up and um, listen to, please listen to this music that I'm working on. Um, I can't afford to pay someone to tell you that it's good, so I have to tell you. <laughs> I'm fully aware that some of you who know me and don't know me will be cool with that. I'm also aware that because of, of the world, there will be some folks that the way that I'm talking probably infuriates them. And that's just the way life is. Please enjoy. Enjoy. <laughs> 